Oh my god, what a pig! <laughs> Hi guys, it's gonna be a bit of a messy video, so I decided to do this little introduction before we kick off and start the video. Um, usually I make one video uh, and for, for one trip, I'll up upload just what I got that day or that trip and make one video out of it. And um, when I don't have enough material to show you, I simply don't upload the video. But went out a couple of times and we did some amazing finds and we well decided to make a combined video of those trips. So what you're going to see right now is, first of all, us digging on the field where a German camp was. The second uh, part is going to be digging a World War II German airfield, an abandoned airfield, of course. Very nice plane parts. Um, and the third, third part is going to be some um, some random spot, but you're going to see that right now. And uh, after that, after the video, I'll be back at you and uh, tell you all about the little giveaway I decided to do. So stay tuned for that. Enjoy the video, guys. See you later. So I just found this, what we believe is a mine. What is it in German? Minenschuhabzeigen. Minenschuhabzeigen. Mine. Uh, Huh? Kriegsmarine mine finds metal. I don't know, you tell me. But it's pretty busted, but hey, who cares? Well done, buddy. First American button. I know we found them by the hundreds here, but it's my first one. And, um,. I'm always happy when I find these. Can you see it? I think you can. But... Ooh, yes! Finally, I've been here for, well, a couple of hours now and all these guys behind me are keep finding dog tags. I got one, finally. I know, it's just a half one, but I don't care, it's my first one here. I found a, a, a part of one uh, a while back, but well, although it's a bit busted, I don't care. I'm happy. Wow. <coughs> Sheep's, Sheep's Head Bay, New York. New York? USMSTC. No, what does it say? USMSTS. No idea, but you Americans probably gonna help me with this. Let me just get it in the sun. And you can see it says 45. Jeez, what a find. I also found this just a couple of inches from the metal. Très cool. This is a beauty, wow. Ooh, just found something good. It was my time to find a medal. Oh, look at this. No, I know what it is. I have the same one. And he knows what it is. Oliver knows what it is. What is it? I know what it is. What is it? This is from Italy. An Italian? Italian fascist. Uh, no way. <laughs> oh. That's a fascist cross. World War II. Oh. It's an Italian fascist uh, cross. Look how mooi die wordt. They fought in uh, Greece. They fought in Greece? Oh wow. Jeez. It looks really nice. I don't know what it is. I don't know what it is. We have an expert here. She's going to tell us what it is. I don't know. I don't care what it is. It's cool. It's metal. And it's mine now. What a beauty.
Oliver called me over, so let's see what he found. Ooh. Oh, wat is het? Weet je dat? Pruisie? Ja, ik dacht, dit doe ik. Pruis is of Pruis is of Pools? Ja, Pools. Ja. Oh. Het lijkt mij een nice. soort hangertje. Zo. Ja. Beautiful. Just got a message from the metal detecting gods. They told me, Mike, we're gonna put something in the ground and you're gonna find it. Because you're number one. I already knew that, but hey, it's nice to have it confirmed, right? Number one. Ooh, ooh. Yeah, focus, come on. Come on. Oh, I think it's silver and says 41, but you already saw that. Paying attention. Where's the sun? That's right here. Oh, nice, right? Beautiful shine to it. Don't know what it is. It's French, I think. Yes, one franc. Is it? Is it silver? One franc silver? Hmm. I doubt it. Nonetheless, it's a beautiful coin. Oh, got it upside down. Happy with this. Tunisia? No way! No way! I know I shouldn't be rowing coins. Oh wow! Tunisia! You gotta be kidding me, right? Woohoo! I really hope I didn't screw up the last images of the, of the Tunisian coin because uh, the camera wasn't on auto autofocus. That's pretty stupid, Mike. But hey, I'm learning as we go and I just found this. Um, there. Really don't know what this, what this is. Let me just turn it around for you. There's absolutely nothing at the back. But the front is nice. Sorry, I have to turn you around again. There it is. No idea what it is, no idea. If you have any thoughts, comment below, please. We just had enough with the, uh, uh, with the field, so we decided to come to a, a forest nearby. And um, I'm oh, just walking around and I noticed this on the ground. Tip of a bomb, of course. Pretty good sign that there's been activity here, so we'll see what we can find here. Somebody uh, forgot his bomb. Pretty big. Don't know what's, uh, what this is, uh, caliber. Um, or which country used them, which side used them. You're probably gonna tell me. Just garbage here and uh, and a bomb and another one. Just my big old foot for size. Jeez. Well, we think it's French. Perhaps even World War One, which you, some of you are probably gonna correct me and give me the right info. Please do. I just found a big stack of these empty cartridges, uh, which have still have some markings. I don't know if it will focus. So let me just try this. <coughs> Doesn't seem to focus. Come on, camera. There it is. Nice. Big pile of them. We can't bring them all. So, just gonna take out a couple of beauties. What you been finding, Patrick? Uh, 
dashboard panel instruments from the Luftwaffe. Right. So uh, dashboard lights. This is Baker light, right? Yeah. This is a switch. Okay. Just trying to focus. Come on with the camera. Ja, mooi man, met minuut tot daar. Ja, raw, nice. Light heads, switches, fuses. Fuses. Ja, instrument klok. Wat is dat? Dit is is het van de light switch. Wat een light switch. You see, more light and out. Out. You can you can turn it. Wow man. Awesome. Jeez. Well, if you detect with Patrick, you gotta really stay by his side because he always finds the good stuff. Really does. Oh, there's even a small marking on it. Manufacturer's marking, uh, Patrick. Okay. Right down there. Wow. Is there more in all? No, the hole is empty now. Okay, yeah, I can see that, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we go to the next one. Well done, buddy. Yep. I was trying to get from there to my back there to get something to drink and I just stumbled upon this big hole full of stuff and well, well, Patrick uh, came and helped me out because I'm really tired. It's very hard digging here, but this is all airplane material, at least that's what we think. Some marking here and I'll clean it at home and show you a picture of it right now. And I'll find some more. Um, this and piece of aluminum with a nice number on it. Gonna do some research at home. And, um, oxygen mask buckle. Oxygen mask buckle, and we think this is the bottom part of a paint um, tin, and with a little fuse here. So this turn around. Oh, let me show you the, the nicest one so far, and the, that's this. Got some writing on it. And I don't think this is uh, this is not metal. This is uh, bakelite. As you can see, I have to clean this. I've been called an idiot because Patrick just found another one of these. And they're not Bakelite, they're aluminum. Oh, this came out. It has some writing on it. Let's see if I can focus. Focus! There. Oh. Any thoughts on this? Let me know. more came out just some small stuff um, I thought this was pretty nice and um, where is it it's right here a little handle let me just see if I get it into the Sun from a plane Patrick yes okay. everything is off a plane Ah, these light bulbs came out as well. These two, and this really nice little bolt. But especially like the little caps right here. These are nice. So I'm taking this with me, and I'll clean it up at home. If there's anything worth showing, you're gonna see that right now. My God, what a pig! <laughs> Oliver just came 
the wash me, to me and he just found this. Look at what a beauty. What a beauty. 216606 and it's it's in one piece. Beauty beauty. Nice. Hi guys, we just uh, came back from uh, visiting uh, um, a German collector, he collects World War II items. And um, man, we had a great time there, I couldn't film it. He has a great collection but he didn't want me to film it. So I bought some stuff of him, I usually don't do that but it, it was fair priced so I thought might as well buy it and or sell it so we can uh, uh, earn something from this trip or um, you know trips cost money so we have to make money to 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 get out here but uh, let me just uh, show you what I've got it's I think it's amazing and um, let's start with this this was a present for my son who's with me right now and uh, he got that from uh, from uh, I'm the very nice guy. I bought this one um, and this one as well. They have um, matching numbers, which is important. Uh, so they uh, really go together all this time. And this one is nicely from 39, 38, sorry. No. Got the mother's cross in gold. My son bought this. The uh, Officers Kriegsmarine, uh, well, what is it, a badge? Uh, this little badge, my son bought this as well. This is what I bought. And I haven't seen this before, but I'm very curious about this thing. And um, So I'm gonna do some searching on the internet about this one. And we have the um, Verwundet and Abzeigen, injured badge. Already have a couple of those, but always like them. Uh, a nice buckle. It's a Hitler Youth buckle with markings. And I also like this one because it still has the uh, original paint. Let me just take it outside for a minute. I don't know if the sun is too bright, but it still has the original green paint. Like it. Um, Minesweeper's badge, also very nice, and I'm gonna hide this for a moment because I think this is the best one. Two uh, sports badge, badges, which are uh, in, in very nice condition, the pin is still on there on both. Very nice. Yeah, very very nice, I love these, I don't have this one at home yet, so I'm gonna keep one of those. And what I consider to be really the, the bomb and I hope it's 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 original it should be the guy says it should be uh, Patrick says it should be and another guy who was with us should, says it's 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 not a reproduction and I love this one I've never even dreamed of owning one of these but man this is cool and I'm not sure if we're gonna gonna sell some I have to because I invested some money in it and um, I have to sell some uh, some of this um, just to afford our trip, otherwise uh, I'm gonna lose money on this trip. But um, yeah, not sure if I uh, yeah I sell it. So you can ask if you have uh, any interest in some of this. But I don't know. I don't know. Not these. No, no. These are mine. Uh, okay. Okay. You can sell these to me. No. So first we're gonna have a sandwich, uh, something to eat and uh, dress up and then we're gonna go somewhere in there to metal detect because the collector, um, very very nice German, he, he sells his collection and he wants to get out of the hobby. Uh, I'm not sure why, I think he has some sort of, sort of issues at home, I don't know, I don't know. If, if he sees this, sorry buddy if I tell you, tell you. Tell this about you, 
don't mean to be rude. But he's, uh, he's uh, quitting the hobby and um, he uh, very kindly gave us some, uh, some information, shared some information about his spots where he found uh, nice stuff in the past. So this is actually one of, uh, one of the spots. So while we're here, let's, uh, ju let's just detect or let's search. Let's dig in! As I just, just told you, uh, the guy was a digger himself and Patrick managed to buy uh, well, pretty much um, well, all his erkennungsmark ID tags and uh, some belt buckles. Still paper, eh? Yeah, uh, yeah. That's some paper. Excuse me. Cool. Verwounded afzijding. We're not sure what this is. It's uh, probably some, some sort of pin. Transport pin. This one is nice as well. The gold. Uh, oh no, no, it's a, it's a black one. It's a black one, but it's uh, missing the paint. Uh, that was a nice party badge. Oh, what is it? Um, um, is it a crash? No. Perfect. Uh, no, I forgot. Sorry. Is this actually gold? No, it's all black. It's all blacks. Mm -hmm. But the black is missing, the paint is gone. Panzer Jäger Azatsabteilung 9. Nice. Panzer Jäger SS op. Uh... Azats. Ja, ah, Azats. Panzer Jäger Azats. Panzer Trainer Dieren Azats Bataillon. Azats uh, means replacement, right? Yeah. It's the replacement battalions. Drie op Azats. How many uh, ID tags are there? I'm at uh, 45. 40, 45, yeah. yeah. Right, nice. Oh, this is in good condition. So, we normally don't buy stuff, but, well, this was something we couldn't let, uh, let us pass because he really, really asked fair, fair prices. So, we had a bit of luck. Good on us. We just found a little dump pit. Maybe it's better good. And um, all sorts of these little bottles came out. Yeah. This is a nice one. Is it? Is it? Oh, yeah. This is a nice one. Still has the... Some broken bottles. But... I believe is a big button. Oh, pretty nice. Let's see what what else comes out. So far, mostly glass. This is this is still closed, by the way. Uh, no, not really. Nice. Little medicine bottles. Can you can, yeah. Something. Patrick is tireless. I'm uh, a bit out of breath. Oh, ow! That was my knee. And um, so far, we've been finding lots and lots of these little bottles and uh, these devastated buttons. It was a big burn pit, as you can see from this bottle right here. And this one, where is it? This one. But pretty nice, pretty nice. We were hoping for a little bit more metal, not glass, but hey, not complaining. I don't know if you can see it, but it's a little uh, quick moving button. Oh, I need a mistake. Yeah, sure. Oh. 
Ja, ein schlechter ist auch nicht. Ja. So, ist das? Knabber? 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 Ja. Yeah. Okay, no, I mean, it's sure it's definitely a Kriegsman. Hope you liked the video. Um, about the giveaway, it's just a small giveaway, but it's it's fun. Uh, the channel has reached 25,000 subscribers and calls for a celebration. And uh, thanks to you guys, uh, the channel uh, has grown and uh, the, the views has grown. So it's, it's time for me to give something back to you guys. Um, so what I decided to do is uh, make these fun little hats. As you know, I always wear caps. And uh, I ordered a couple of them with the Iron Mike logo or text on them. And uh, I can give away three to, uh, to you guys. I wish I could give out 25,000, but I can't. So three to give away. And the only thing you have to do, I started a, a Facebook group called Iron Mike Metal Detecting. What you gotta do is um, give it a like and give it a share and I'll pick three of you out in a couple of weeks time and contact you and send them out. So for any details go to the Facebook page, uh, should be on there right now and um, I would like to thank you for your support. Um, if you would like to support the channel a bit more there's a tip jar somewhere up there or down there on the YouTube channel. Um, Thanks you so much for watching and for your subscription. See you guys next time. Bye bye.